Uh, nowadays I'm using Ubuntu as my primary OS and uh, not to say it has been an easier transition but but nonetheless it has just been fun troubleshooting and finding solution to every problem I face and this week I was having a problem with my printer comma scanner actually the uh, scanner wasn't working fine although the printer was working really fine out of the box I was just having problem with my scanner and so in this video I'll show you how to fix it. So just bear with me for a few minutes, I guess, and let's get started. So the first step is to download something called HP Lib. So to do this, just search Google and click on the lit and just click on the link that is from HP, which will bring you to this site. And then click HP Lib, uh, download HP Lib and choose a distro and you're ready to go. Now, open the folder where the dot run file is downloaded and right click on it and under permission, allow it to be executed as program. Or if you want to do it with terminal, just right click and open the folder in terminal and type the command chmod plus x and name of program. Just type hp and hit tab to autocomplete. The file has been permitted to be executed and you just can't double click it you have to do it in terminal so the next thing is under the same directory type dot forward slash and the program name that is type hp and hit tab and it will start doing it works it will ask for installation mode i would recommend with uh, to go with automatic unless you really want to get around the uh, all those custom stuffs which i haven't tried and it is going to ask you for the root password and some silly questions and just let it do its thing. So after doing all the stuffs, a GUI will appear telling you to connect the printer with the device. I connected it with USB. I think you still need to temporarily connect with USB if you want to connect your printer wirelessly. However, I'm going to use uh, USB here only. Uh, so now click next and at the printer and do check the send test to send paste to send test paste to printer just to make sure it is working all right so i thought it was all done and my scanner gonna work pretty well now so i opened the document scanner but damn it i still couldn't identify my scanner but this time it was different well, the HP prompt up here and it said it needed some proprietary plugins to get installed in order to work well. So I said okay and made the deal with Devil <laughs> and it installed. And uh, it fixed all of my problem and my scanner is working pretty fine now. So I hope you like this video and do let me know how you uh, do let me know if it really solved your problem or not. If you're having some similar problem with your HP printer. So uh, that's all for today. Uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.